What's up? Happy uh, Homebrew Wednesday. I have with me... <gasps> that is the Tongue Thrasher. Look at that. Not a ton. Actually, decent lacing there. Look at that. It's only been... Um, it's only been fermenting in the bottles. Well, sorry. Carbonating in the bottles for about two weeks. <sighs> that's the closest. And I didn't try for this. But that's the closest I've smelt a beer to... Uh, to Stone, um, one of Stone's IPAs that I've smelled in a while. Oh man, just a definite citrus smell. Um, definitely some caramel. Um, just awesome. I mean, look at the color. It's got a little bit of um, freeze haze just because it's in a real cold glass. So as soon as it hit it, I saw it kind of thicken up, but let's smell it. Now, I know I just said smell it, and that was clearly a uh, taste test, but wow, that was awesome. The alcohol comes on at the end, you really uh, taste it. I think when I did the gravity reading, it was around, um, I think it was around uh, like 9%. I think it was 8.8 .8 or 9, I can't remember if it was 8.8 .8 or 9.8, .8. I have it written down somewhere, but wow, that was awesome. Man. I'm not going to drink those quickly. I'm going to sit back and enjoy those. Oh, lots of things going on here. We've got the yearly hookup, the tagalongs, Fox's tagalongs. It's mainly Samoas and um, tagalongs and oh, mints. How do you forget that there's mints in there? Um, that's what's going on. Tonight's a crazy night because I'm a tax accountant, so things are crazy. And I'm also look at those bad boys. You guys can see them. We got some nice steaks in the freezer. Those are some fillets from a cow I bought at the fair, and some ribeyes. Mmm, they're gonna go great with this IPA. And I gotta get back to it, but um, just wanted to let you guys know I got some big things going on. Not this weekend, but next weekend, gonna have a big brew day. So uh, uh, look forward to that. Um, also. I got a big shipment from Midwest. Um, had a disaster in that. I'll go. Uh, I'll go into that later. Wasn't really their fault, from what I can tell. Um, but just really screwed my plans up. And uh, I'll go into that. Go into what I'm gonna brew over this weekend, and then hopefully um, some Q and A I'd like to do with you guys. Uh, so if you could private message me, or um, just comment at the bottom of my uh, videos, I'd really like to get into that and uh, answer back with you guys. And also, if there's anyone in Maryland who uh, homebrews, let me know. I'd like to do something um, with someone else. It's always great to have a uh, beer hand. And um, that's about it. I'm going to get back to cooking these steaks and cooking dinner and drinking an IPA. So, peace.